Hi everyone, welcome to raigurkul.com. Today we will see creating a project budget plan using Confluence templates. Whether you are managing a small projects or large one, budgeting is a key to success. Let's walk through it step by step. First, let's explore Confluence. If you are unfamiliar with it, Confluence is a powerful tool for collaborations and documentations. For this budget plan, we'll use a pre-designed template that makes things much easier. If you don't know about the Confluence, feel free to refer my complete Confluence playlist. I already created more than 30 videos on it. If you wanted to learn and understand each and every step, feel free to refer the playlist from the description tab. Now, how do you usually track project budgets? Do you use tools like Confluence or do you prefer spreadsheets? Kindly let me know in comments so that other viewers can also aware of it, which all tools are available and how other people are using. Now, simply head to the Confluence where I will open my Confluence instance and here when you'll click on templates, it will open the templates for you where you have to navigate it to the budget proposal templates here click on use and this will open a pre-designed template for you how you can manage it so this templates has everything you need to break down cost estimate spending and stay on track here you can see this contains the project details like project organizers project name teams project dates approvals budget requirements and cost where you can track expense item their explanations deadline and tentative cost for it here you can also plan as a roadmap planner where deliverables are also tracked if you want even you can use more related stuff let's start fill it out the templates comes with several sections as i mentioned project overview where or objective where we are describing about the projects here you can also provide the project title let's consider we are building a similar kind of applications like amazon here rather than using the other name we'll just define the amazons as a project name what is the objective which we wanted to achieve it let's consider we are building an automation on amazon website how we can achieve it what all objects of it what we wanted to achieve all those factors we have to define it here after that who is the organizer so let's consider i am the organizer in this case now title is done maybe i will just click on this and just add at the rate and specify the name here it will add the name of the person where we will have the organizer name project name as i mentioned i am just writing amazon automation team which all teams are involved let's consider we wanted to add as developer uat and qa if you want you can just specify the team's name who or are working with it project dates what is the tentative dates we can insert it here if you want you can just add forward slash and here you can just mention the date whichever dates you are looking for approvers who is the approver of this project so you can specify it here in terms of budget or requirements and cost here you can specify each and every expenses so direct cost of automations is the license cost where we can define the license since cost where we have to give which all licenses are required let's consider we are using rpa based tool one of the tools which I am regularly using is UiPath. Let's consider we wanted to use this one UiPath Orchestrator. And if you have any specific requirements, you can add that as well. These are the automations tool. If you are utilizing the Excel, the cost of Excel licenses are also involved. If we are using some other licenses, you have to define each and everything. Deadline. What is the deadline of these cost? Where till Till what time this cost will be required? Till the time this automations will be there, we need UiPath. So here we'll use forever. 
cost in terms of cost let's consider i wanted to add the cost as dollar 500 i'm just giving any rough cost apart from this we also need all resources are working let's consider we have four resources the cost of all four resources are added as 600 all the costs are in usd we can just define usd so we don't have to write dollar here we can directly add the number indirect costs are server cost system cost operating system cost we have to include all those i'm just writing general cost and here let's consider i wanted to add as 800 equipment cost if we have anything where we can define the system cost travel cost if there is anything involved other costs are meetings if we are using some rewards and coupons for the developer who is doing good work we can include it here and then we have to add the final cost where we can add the total cost of this so let's consider we have these cost where 1100 plus 8 1900 dollar is the total cost which we can define it here project timelines are totally up to your requirements how you wanted to add it when you wanted to deliver it you can add it so as of now it's mentioned as q1 and q2 but in this you can just change this view or data and accordingly you can keep this planner in your face so that's how we can add budget project budget plan timelines or deadlines whatever we want we can manage it through confluence now another question is what's the biggest challenge you face when managing project budgets feel free to share in the comments so that other viewers can also get to know about it and they will take learnings from there so one of the best features in this template is tracking your estimates and actual cost which you are going to spend which will keep you updated and once these are done or over under budget in real time don't worry it will have the final calculated totals for you after you're done click on publish and this will be published for your team member so once your budget is ready share it with your teams for collaborations Confluence make it easy to gather feedback and track updates. After publishing, you can always share within your team members, which will help you to get their final feedback. Here you can see copy link. You can directly copy the link and share with your team members, or you can use share functionality, which will help you to get ideas on this page. This is a huge time saver when working with a multiple stakeholder where other stakeholders can also update the details directly from here rather than sending you on email that's the reason confluence are centralized repository where you can manage all your documentations related to projects and that's it your project budget plan is ready using this confluence template you can stay organized and in control of your projects finances helping you to avoid any surprises down the line thank you for watching if you found this video helpful don't forget to like and subscribe also let me know in the comments how you are using confluence for your projects till then happy learning we'll see you in further part of the video thank you for watching